To write the balanced net ionic equation for NiNO3 plus NH4-3PO4, we first need to balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. That'll look like this. If you need help balancing the molecular equation, there's a link in the description of this video. Next, we'll write the states based on the solubility rules. So compounds with the nitrate ion and with the ammonium ion are very soluble. So all of these are aqueous. Then this phosphate, compounds with phosphate in general are insoluble. So we have an S for a solid. So we have our states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into ions, and that's going to give us the complete ionic equation. That'll look like this. So this is the balanced complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out the spectator ions. They're on both sides. So in the reactants on the top, we have six nitrate ions. Products, we have six nitrate ions. They're spectator ions, so we're going to cross those out. Here in the reactant, six ammonium ions, and again in the product, six ammonium ions. Spectator ions get crossed out. What's left is the net ionic equation for nickel 2 nitrate plus ammonium phosphate. Let's remove the spectator ions. And this is our balanced net ionic equation. You can see that the atoms, they're balanced, and the charge is balanced as well. 3 times 2 plus, that's 6 plus. 2 times 3 minus is 6 minus. Net charge of 0 in the reactants. This is neutral, net charge of 0. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.